Hi everyone. So I wanted to share a story time today. I haven't done one for a while and I've been contemplating on all of the stories I have to share and this one's this one's kind of funny, although a little bit sad too in kind of a weird way. So this is back in my banking career. So I was in my like early to mid twenties. Um, I had worked my way up. I was running our front line in charge of all the tellers. We had just hired a, a woman to come work for us. She, um, at the time appeared to be much older to me, I would guess. Um, and if you'd ask me that age, she was in her fifties. Um, now if you ask me, I'm not really sure how old she was. Um, but she always talked about going out with her girls and getting her drink on every night. And I was like, wow, like I'm, you know, 23 and I can't do that. And still make it to work in the morning. Well, one day I'm in my office and it was time for her to come in for some training and I liked it to do training in the office one on one, so there were no distractions. And you know, if there were any questions or anything that was confusing, you know, whoever was training had the opportunity to really just sit there and have that one on one time with me. So she walked into my office quite promptly, tripped over a cord, and then passed out on my office floor. And when I say passed out, I mean legitimately passed out, drunk on my floor. Now I wasn't quite sure what to do at first I was like oh my god she's unconscious is she hurt and then I heard the snoring and realized she had just literally passed out called my boss he was our CEO and it was a very small institution so it wasn't that far up the chain to go and I was like hey um this is happening right now in my office what do you want me to do um because obviously I knew we were gonna have to to let her go you can't be drunk at work but the fun part, we couldn't actually let her leave the facility until we knew she had sobered up. So they put her in a conference room for several hours, got her some coffee, made sure she was sober before they let her have her keys so she could drive home. Um, super awkward to have someone in your conference room all day knowing you can't let them leave. Um, but also knowing it's the absolute safest thing in the world to do for them and everyone else in the world that they're going to encounter. So that's my story time for today. I hope you enjoyed it and um, I'm looking forward to sharing my next one with you. We'll talk soon.